これが本物の敬礼だ心臓を捧げよレッツシックゴーおースクワードベイビー Why are my eyes so fucking red bro I swear I'm not high I swear <laughs> Whatever, let's just do this. We were back with Attack on Titan. Last episode, we went to the headquarters, the old headquarters. They were kind of useless because they were too far away from everything. But now they're the perfect hiding place for Eren. So he's gonna be there with Levi and his squad. We met a bunch of new people. We got some stats as well, you know, some kill stats, some, some assist stats, which I thought was cool. We didn't get Levi's stats, unfortunately, but I guess they did it on purpose, you know, to keep a little bit of a mystery there because we all know how nasty he is. Like we've seen him and he has this aura around him. So they're just keeping a little bit more mystery, you know, which I'm not mad at, you know, you do you show, um, you know, they got me thinking and that's always good so yeah other than that everything was really just information based we found out a lot about the titans the experiments hanji was doing they shut down after not having sunlight some of the titans shut down faster than others probably because of size because the bigger one was like awake three hours longer than the smaller one but maybe there's a different component to that as well Aaron was supposed to help with something um with the experiments i'm not sure what the plan was but in the end they got killed some soldiers or some people pulled up but they definitely had 3d maneuver gear because somebody said he saw them get away with it so we've got ops all around us because they don't want us to find out anything about titans and then Aaron had the question who's the enemy or what is the enemy and it's like yeah like we're not only fighting titans we're fighting our own people in our own ranks now i do not understand what reasoning humans could have to deny information from the titans but it will be interesting to find out yeah other than that i think that's about it as always feel free to leave a like a comment check out my discord and let's go oh and if my voice sounds a little off i'm feeling a little bit under the weather so but nothing serious so we're all good <laughs> なんで俺ら訓練兵の中で犯人探しなんだ I mean, what did you expect, bro? I guess, you know, you're young, you're naive, you're not thinking about it, you, you feel invincible when you're young, and then you just get a rude waken, awakening. That death still is like out of nowhere, bro. Aaron's words have the tendency to just stick in your mind, bro. It's all it's all about that charisma, man. Oh yeah, that's oh man. Yeah, he told him he thinks he's a good leader. That's right. Did they decide yet where they're going? Oh. <laughs> patient, Shadow. Be patient. <laughs> mm, I knew that shit, boy. We met his real self. A good leader. Strong leader. なら自分に従ったらいいんじゃないのうーん。だよ。That was hard。あるみ、お前まで。Oh, so she's not coming with? I mean, that's fair. It's a little bit surprising because she's so nasty, but. Oh, that's fair. It's a little bit surprising because she's so nasty, but. 
どれだけいるのか。You probably be surprised, bro. お前の弟にうちを志願するやつはいるのか。Yeah, you know, I held a speech or two for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you should pay me some sponsorship money because I, I, I rock that shit for you. Like, I, I, I went off, okay? <laughs> I spazzed with my speeches. <laughs> okay, let's go. Where are we going? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm a little. I took some medicine, so I'm not all there today. Oh, yeah, the fucking ceremony. Where they all are gonna choose where they're going. John! I can't believe this guy turned out to be like a stand up dude. What okay, let me know. What's your motivation, bro? It's Marco, right? He told you you're a good leader, so now you feel responsible. Okay, so maybe not Marco. I feel that, I feel that. Yeah, if you're like not, not in this 100% for yourself, or not for yourself, but from your own accord, then you're not gonna do well. He's real about it. しかしたこの戦いで人類はこれまでにないほど勝利へと前進したうんうんウィカーダブユー彼が間違いなく我々の味方であることは彼の命がけの働きが証明しているさらに我々は彼によって巨人の信仰を阻止するのみならず巨人
俺はもともと憲兵になるために村を出たんだ母ちゃん喜ぶぞ Come on, Connie. See, I want these kids to join, and then I just, I just see them all just dying. <laughs> I'm gonna be so sad. <laughs> Did he scream for real, or was that, was that in his head? <clears throat> we got him. Look, we got, we got a good few recruits. Shine to you, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. I'll t e l では今ここにいる者を新たな調査兵団として迎え入れるこれが本物の敬礼だ心臓を捧げようレッツゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴーゴー Okay, okay. Okay, wait. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 after, after that speech, you know, 30% will die and all that. That's a good as number. And I feel like if, if the thing with the Titans wouldn't have happened, it wouldn't be that many. I feel like. Because you would think, like, if. That the Titan situation would, would have scared away most, but I think actually the opposite happened. I think those that weren't gonna go,、um, weren't gonna go either way, seeing Titans or not seeing Titans. But I think some of these cats here saw what was going on and actually changed their mind because they saw their friends die. They saw what Eren did, what he can do. They sacrificed a lot. And they're like, well, you know what? I'm in this shit now. You know, I'm not gonna let my friends die for nothing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out there, you know? And also like Eren's speeches, Mikasa's speech on the roofs, now Eren's speech, all of that, like all of that kind of marinated and kind of like formed these soldiers that we have now. And like I said, I'd rather have, I'd rather have these 18 cats Behind me, then 200 fucking military police. I'm sure there's cool military police people, but you know what I mean. Is it right hand or left hand when you salute? It's weird. Damn, why though? Because they want to get Eren in and out? Oh, it's a practice run. 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 Yeah, humans all around us, bro. Ops. To find the 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 ops. Is it, is that, did I get it right? Did, is he actually trying to lure out the traitors by giving out information and doing this mission? Even a little bit of, little bit of taste, you know? Come on, bite, bite, fishy, bite. <laughs> oh, damn, he actually. It does feel a long, long time. How long has it been? Well, the short guy. <laughs> the short guy. That's funny, bro. Levi's a short king, okay? Stand up, my short king. Hell yeah! I think this is summer vacation, bro. Yeah, what's up, boy? Yeah, he didn't know, bro. He doesn't know yet. Yeah. I don't think he's going to be dead. I don't think he's going to be dead. Somebody told me to watch that episode again and like, go frame for frame, and I can figure out how Marco died. I still have to do that. Ooh, we getting new drip? We getting sauced out? Ooh, okay.、Mm. Yeah, we're swagged out now. Let's be honest. Their uniform is cold as fuck. 
I'm not gonna lie. Oh, rest in peace, brother. Because I'll cross over to Starashina. So I died all you could. Chiga, Ellen, Hio Tatakoto stay. Ma, Mikasa, what? Pshit. Hontorashi. Kyojin in a tower. Mikasa, I'll cross over to Starashi, Tenua. Kyokuni ne the Kotodana. Smarty, oh my, what Kyojin no Chikara no Sonza or Yamama de Shirana Katashi. Well, yeah, I lost control, but I gained, I gained it back. But I still lost it. You're not wrong. I thought you were Marco no Yoni. Eren got shot, and I was just shot in the arm. Jan, I'm at Koko de Eren. Why is he making a fuss? What's the meaning? He he's got the right to ask some questions. That's okay. Shimo, you're like me, right? Eren is dying for me. You're not dying for me. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, it's a good right to to ask questions. Not everybody owes the life that. To Aaron Mikasa, you know what I'm saying? Not everybody loves him like you do. Man, I can't believe how much I like Sean now. It's crazy, bro. Yeah, man, he's putting his trust in Aaron, bro. Can't believe like how far John has already come from being a little fuck boy to this. Crazy. Love it. Oh, what, we rolling out or what? I love these rollouts. I love them. They're so epic every time. The music, man. Ah, gets me pumped. That used to be him as a kid, remember? He used to look at them like that with Mikasa. Ah, it's coming. Ah, I'm hyped. Bro, I I'd, I'd roll with them 100%. Ooh, look at them. They're a bunch of fucking devils, bro. Ooh, look at this dude, bro. Look at this dude. I actually got like, I got a little teary-eyed there, but it's, it's more because I'm sick, okay? And I got goosebumps, but look at this dude. Look at this dude's face, bro. Does he look like he's playing games? Does he look like he's playing fucking games? Come on now, he's not playing, bro. Advance! That shit was epic, bro. Oh, God. Uh, I actually, oh, I got goosebumps. Ooh. I love that um, they showed the two kids. Remember, um, I think it was, I think it was episode one. Him and Mikasa were looking and, and Aaron was like jumping and trying to see and now he's sitting there and they're rolling out and oh, I can't wait, man. I'm also scared because we let's just say we haven't had the best track record with survivors on missions. I think every mission we've lost like a lot of people. Uh, so I'm I'm scared if they're gonna continue with that pace. Because if they're continuing with that, then you know, pretty soon we're just gonna have like two people left. <laughs> but um, I don't know. Let's see what happens. I'm I'm hyped. Like I said before, like Aaron Aaron is a closed book. Like. Um, I feel like he wants to like weed out the traitors because remember when he was in his office and the guy who sniffs people I forgot his name. He was like man I know you're up to something like you you won't even tell me and he was like I'll tell you when the time comes then he asked Aaron the question about you know what or who is the enemy so he's aware of something in his surroundings and people you know plotting and shit and betraying and i feel like like i said he's trying to lure them out he's trying to make them make a wrong step and once they make that wrong step or a step too far he'll snatch him Aaron is Aaron seems smart and he's really he doesn't what i like what i like about him is he doesn't waste words i don't i don't like people that waste words like that talk for like two hours and they didn't say anything, you know what I mean? Like those kind of people. Aaron has these short, crisp, to the point speeches. And he's not gonna bullshit you. I love that. He's not gonna bullshit you. Because he doesn't want bullshit guys that 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 see the world through like I don't know, pink glasses. He wants the people that are prepared to die and that know that the possibility is high that they'll die. That's the men you want. Because if they know what they're getting into, then chances are a lot higher that they won't panic in a situation especially because now they already have experience with fighting titans even if it's only a little that first shock of fighting a titan for the very first time is gone you know that very first encounter shock is like that's done they're still 
super inexperienced don't get me wrong but that first shock moment like that's over with and i feel like that's worth a lot and john once again stepping up you know asking aaron the hard questions which i, I think he has every right to do so aaron is like the, the main reason more people joined because they see hope you know they see hope in what what he's doing you know what he can do for humanity and with with this power so i feel like it's fair you know they're like you know you, i heard you lost control like you know I'm, I'm putting my faith in you so you need to get your shit together and you know that's all, that's all fair game you know i feel like mikasa just kind of blindly follows Aaron everywhere which is it's cute and all and you know she always every time Aaron says I'm gonna go there I'm gonna go there she's like I'm gonna go with you I'm gonna go with you every time and I get it you know you owe him a life debt he saved you from these um these slave slave owners or whatever murderers robbers everything in the book so I definitely get where she's coming from but not everybody has that relationship with Aaron not everybody grew up with him in the same family after that you know so they they just need some facts anyways i'm super super hyped man i got i got so hyped in the end man when he said advance bro as always leave a like leave a sub check out my discord and i'll see you guys around